Fit like a bee, Danny Boy here, and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2. Here is our ScotRail Intercity arriving in Aberdeen. That is nice. What does the, what does this one say? The Sir Walter Scott. Cool. Right, so that train is heading in. There is one at the other side, which I need to uh, actually release. The one that is at Fort William, because it's currently stopped for the moment. There we go. Let's fire you up and get going. Now, I think I can remove this depot now. Yes. Now, we're going to upgrade one train, and then we're going to go and do something new, shiny and new. Right. Uh, one train we're going to upgrade, or is it you? Yeah, the Scottish Airports train, right? We are going to manage this, whoa. Uh, we are going to manage this vehicle, yes. And we're going to change it up with, I'm going to replace it with, where are you, my diesel multiple unit friend? The Provincial Sprinter. Now, I've been reading up on this. The 156 Super Sprinter was adopted by many lines. 114 were made. And this was the livery uh, before branding, uh, what it actually came up. Now, it was used in ScotRail, down at Thames Valley, lots of other places. So, we're going to add that. Now, it's only got a capacity of 40. That's okay. We're going to replace it. There we go, the first Provincial Sprinter, 156 Super Sprinter, not the 150, is on the go. Look at it, it looks cool. Now later on it will come with the ScotRail uh, actual badge design, the livery, the actual ScotRail logo. The first one uh, actually appears in like 1994, so we're actually a hot minute from actually getting them. We've got these ones as well, Scott Rail Wagons. I was going to change up some more to the Intercity livery, but I want to keep a sort of mix of trains rolling around. Now, however, I have sort of screwed up. Right, this is the Central Belt one. So I may actually change this one up because we've pretty much got uh, the one that goes green this is the highland line one uh scotland central belt and scotland northeast to southwest is that other one and then we've got scotland north northwest this this is the blue one so there's actually two of these they're not very well spaced out i forgot to actually set one to wait so i might because we've already got that one i might upgrade uh this one to the inner city livery there are two of. Yeah, I think it'd be cool to get one of them rolling into Glasgow as well. So we'll manage up these vehicles. Select and select. Uh, we'll replace them with... Current capacity is what? 84? 84 seems fine. Uh, diesel. Variants. This. Down at the bottom. Scott Rail. Add. Passengers. Uh, which one is it? Yeah, this one. One, two, three, four, four. Give it five. 125? Yeah, 125. Replace. Where is it? It's there. I think. I think you're the one. There we go. So we've now got one heading across to Glasgow as well, which is pretty cool. So we've used up all the Scott Rail liveries. Now today. I want to go from, uh, where do I want to go from? Yeah, I want to go from Wales, right? So, uh, from Milford Haven to Swansea to Cardiff. And then I want to come around and go to Bristol, Reading, and then down into London. Now, I was kind of worried because London Town, uh, this railway station here is, is pretty busy. And I don't think I can extend this anymore, which kind of sucks. So, I'm going to actually take it, because I think I can, uh, and then put it into this one. Now, that's going to be interesting. Uh, this one only has two. 
which is completely fine, right? London has started to extend over this way, which is sort of okay. Uh, it's going to come to a point where Dover is going to merge with uh, London, probably. Now, I'm pretty sure every single one of these super laggy down here at London. Uh, if we pause it, it might be slightly less loggier. Yes, it is. Right, so... Reds. Where's all the reds? Yeah, red there, red there, red at far side, red at near side, near side, far side, far side, far side. Yep, so they're all sort of done. Now I could place a... Actually, can I configure this even more? I can. I could bring it out this side. But I want it to go in, uh, into the south because we want to use up some some platforms there. So how am I going to get that? Right, probably take it to about here and then try and bridge it over this. And then it's going to have to fold into there and head out to here. Now, not every platform here at Reading is being used. Excellent. So we want to connect it up to this left-hand line here. Now, the problem being is I probably set these two lines here to be on this far right. No, I didn't. Oh, I'm a genius. Okay, don't know why I didn't do that, but anywho. Right, let's try and get it from this side first. Right, it's heading down. I don't think the other side is heading down. I think it's heading on the flat. Is it? Ooh, that looks pretty high, actually. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure it's it's on the flat. Right, so... Tunnel. Tunnel, please. Connect up to there. Yes. Now, hold on, because I am going to have to branch this off. Uh, I've actually selected Katanari. I don't want Katanari. Right, I need you to pop off here. Right, and I'm not caring about the speed because I'd rather have them not have their supersonic speeds riding into London there. Uh, this house will be removed, which means this is probably going to have to go, which I'm actually quite delighted about. Uh, right, how am I going to cross this over? How are you going to cross this over? Maybe go this way. Right. You're trying to go down. I'd like you to stay up. I've run out of money again. So, right. Let's just get rid of everything. Right. And give me one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There we go. Like ten billion. Oh no. We lost my glorious bit of track. Now. Have this go up, yes. Now I'm happy to have it as brick, right? Brick is fine. I need to see where the brick is. What color is that? Okay, that's loud. Right, we're happy to have that be loud then. And then we're gonna take it down. And it needs to come down quite quickly because we need to get it in right we're getting a bridge pillar collision which is no no surprise this I knew was gonna happen so what I'm gonna do is we're gonna change it up for I'd love to use this give it a mix however it would have to be I don't think we're gonna be able to mix and match this I think it's going to have to be something like that, so... And then it transfers over to that. That looks kind of strange, so... I might actually just make the bridge all the same. I was going to have my brick at one side, brick at the either side, with something in the middle. But I think we're going to have to bite the bullet and... Go over this way. Now... Keep going up. Right, so bridge, pillar, collision. Uh, I've taken that from the wrong side. I should probably do this side first. 
Now why will this side not? You're kidding, right? Okay, have that come down there. Have that come across to here. Wait. Right. Yeah, have it go up and then down. Okay, right, we're getting super duper madness there. Now, can I get this in like a sort of silver livery? I can. Well, it's like a grey. Yeah, we're going to take that. Too much slope collision. Oh no! Bridge pillar collision. Ah, oh, really? So it's not high enough over here, right? No, it wants to push shift. No, push and shift ain't going to do anything. It's still going to collide with that piece of track there. So, what we have to do is delete this whole thing again. Right, or you all the way back there. Now, I'm not sure if this is the actual fix for this. Because it's going to be even lower. Yeah, it actually needs to come further back. So try it at about there. Right, that should be far enough away, right? Wow, I can even get Brick Bridge in there, but I won't be able to get the second, uh, the other side in, so let's go with that. Girder bridge and the grey. Okay, let's attempt this now. Ooh. Sweet. Right, so we've cleared that section, which is magical. Into there. Awesome. Now, I want to turn and face away from London because it's so laggy, right? Pop you into there. Collision because there's traffic lights there. Traffic lights, semaphores, signals. Not traffic lights. Right, so you go into there. We head up here. Branch off to the left. Go into this platform. And then we're on the way again once more. Now, this can continue. Hold on. Can it continue? No, I want it to actually, yeah, come out and then snap on that side. And then it can go up. Right, is that maintaining? No, it wasn't. It was trying to go up there. Right, now at some point, we are going to have to pop this into this line and cross it over to the other side. Because this one heads up to Bristol. No, we want to go to Bristol. Okay. Uh oh. I've just seen. Okay, that works. Right, hold on though. Oh my god, I can actually get it in there as well. Woofed. Right, that was scary. I thought it was going to be way too close to the old uh, iron ore mine there. I need to get more iron ore up and running as well. So we'll be hitting up freight again in another episode. Might do something with farming. Get some food running. I don't actually know who requires food. I'm thinking about trying to knock off a few more shopping lists. So we've got London's shopping list is basically complete with corn mats, coffee, fuel, and mail. And now I want to knock off a few more if possible. Uh, pop you up. To there. Now, Bristol is where it's going to be slightly interesting. 
So you are coming in. So we've got a line that goes out that way and it can go somewhere. So that's going to be a different train. And where are we going now? See, I want to come in this side and then get over that side. Is that... Probably not going to be possible because this is heading up the way. Mm -hmm. What madness, what manner of madness have you committed here? I mean, this could, there could be a different tunnel pops out here and then goes around here. Probably not, because there's no room for it now. Oh, great. I've got room to extend out this way. And we will, because we need to go up to... Uh, round the block, basically, to uh, Tidfault. But this one has to stay on this left-hand line. That it does. Now, I could come out of Redden. Ah, uh, Gloucester Station's at this weird, weird angle over here. Alright, so how are we going to do this? Woofed. Will you go out flat? Right. That bit of track there, it looks like it's trying to go up. So if I take this down... I may be able to get another tunnel in here. Now that looks kind of stupid and I think it's going to look kind of stupid here. Yes it is. As predicted. Right, what we can do, however... Now this line at that side is going to be... Quite literally... Not redundant, but we're going to have to place it somewhere else. Bring it over the back here and take it into there. Which again in its own little way is kinda kinda madness. Alright, you snap onto there. Right. This to here. Okay, that's wild. If I can pop this in here without it being uh, into there, yes. And then from here, we'll go into there. Now, we should do it from this side first. Okay, it doesn't like going from that side. Doesn't like going in there. How far? Right, it's really short. So it means the train's going to have to slow down before coming into uh, Bristol there. I mean, I could continue this down. So let's think about this. Pull you out. Yeah, you're going up. Alright, and then I sort of need you to go over that bridged section. Which it won't do. Yeah, you head up. Over here. Go about there, actually. And I think I can tie you in. Like, tight, tighter to there. I think that's going to be the easiest way to do it. Uh, slightly. Right, head down. Can't head down, apparently. What? Why the hell not? Oh, that is it, heading down. Where does this start clipping with? That. About there. It's fine. Bring that into there. Right, delete. I don't really want to delete that, but I now know that that down section is sort of okay. Oh, you connect into there. 
<laughs> no, that was insane. Why would you even try that? Don't know. It was worth a shot. Wait. Oh, too much, too much curvature. Okay, what if I get a little bit over here, a little bit over here. Give me a tighter turn down into there. Now it's trying to create this corner here, which is pretty insane. Alright, hold on. What if I make that corner less of a sort of insane variety? We're getting there. Right, come round to about there, right? Right, this is going to be too much. Why are you trying to connect into that platform? That's stupid. Oh my god, this is a nightmare. I'm thinking about deleting this station and literally rebuilding it. In fact... Right, off you go. <laughs> Right, the game is paused, so we're okay. Right. Make it. Buildings. Uh, I wanted old school. In fact, we'll give... Give Bristol a new one. Right, make it 240 meters. Give it six platforms straight off the bat. Spin you round. Place it in there. One building shall be removed. I'm going to have to rearrange these tracks as well. Right, pull that back to there, right? Mmm, now we've made this one. Alright, hold the fort. How do you go in there? Yeah, you're gonna be reinstated shortly once I mix a few lines about now tracks I want this to go flat 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 also flat flat. Now that's giving me a tunnel. Ooh, don't really want a tunnel. Where else can this go? It's already going at Exeter. We can get it going round to Bournemouth, no problem. So, again, right, let's have a look at this, because I now think... Right, so you into there. Into the middle. Pop you into there, like so. Now, what we want to do is get that into there, that into here, bring that out to there, this out to there, that. Yeah, this is on a different elevation. This is what I'm scared of. That we'll get wild track over ballast. This might be okay. So far, so good. Now this one. That's okay, and that's okay. Wow. Why did I make this so difficult for myself? Uh, right, give me large, please. Go big or go home. There we go. <laughs> right. So there is a train that is currently confused. 
That's understandable. I can now get rid of uh, this. And I can bring this straight down and into there. You come back up here to that. Right. And I can now bring you around. Oh. Going down. All right, going to there. Three buildings will be removed, such as progress. Right. So, who's confused now? London Western Manage Line. So at Bristol. So Reading to Bristol. You're not going in on one now. You're going in on three. Okay, on the way back, you're going in on four. Ta-da! Here, and there, here, and there, here, and there. Uh, just one at this side, one at that side. Auto save. Now is not the time. Right, so we're all good. Place that there. Place you here and you there. Right, so we've just folded that in just before it heads up. And then one and two. Over the bridge here. Over to there. And then we need to continue on. up the sort of south coast of Wales here. Right, remove that bit of road. You can already see that it's going to be problematic. I'll have you pop round there. Keep going along here. Now I will take a tunnel. Yes, we shall take a tunnel. Go to there, right? Pop you into this left hand side. Now there's reason for this. Is there a reason for this? Yes, there is. Okay, and then you're gonna have no idea where freight is gonna go over here. Not the faintest idea. I may plant a freight station like sort of in the middle of Cardiff and Swansea. Right, there's a huge gouge, huge cut into the land there. That's okay, nothing the smoothing tool can't handle. Right, now, freight station probably going to go at that side if able. Now, I've not used this station yet, and it's a bit loud for... Can I cut you down substantially? 18, 8. No, it's actually the same amount. Oh, I really want to use this as well. Because it's kinda it's kinda cool. But it's just super, super loud. Uh right. No, not not you then. What other terminus stations does one currently possess? None. I think it's going to have to be a new one. Now, where can I go with this? We are going to head out this way at some point. So, one, two, three, four. Three. A three. Yeah, three is fine. Right, you go. In there. Right, freight is going to go up that end. Yes. 
I believe it's so. Right. Now, tracks. Actually, this should be four. Potentially. That's okay. Right, no weird bridges or anything. That's sweet. Yeah, and I'm going to want to pull this out here. So that's that one. Because I am going to head... This is going to seem weird. But I'm going to have a track that goes along here. And then I'm going to try and get a track that goes up the valley here. And, yeah, yeah, there's the start of it. And then connects into here. Is that going to work? Who the hell knows? Stay tuned to find out. <laughs> right, but really, this line that goes all the way to London is now, technically, finito. Finito magneto, right. Let's get some signals up here. So, stop you there. Stop this here, have that and that there. I'm gonna hit this with the smoothing tool like right now, unless I for lest I forget. Which way is it? It's that way. All right. So I'll smooth that along there. Now, smoothing is overrated. If you've ever been on a new road, highway, motorway, dual carriageway, train track, tram track, etc. If you're going through a new section and then it's actually been, they've had to dig away the land to create a sort of little valley to go through, you will see that it's not smooth. It is actually quite sharp after they've finished the, and they leave it. It is quite a sharp gouge into the land, but what they often do is, to hide it, they plant trees. So, like, up beside Aberdeen just now, there's the new western peripheral bypass route. And you can see areas where they've cut in to the land to make the in some parts it is an actual roller coaster it's quite wild actually but some parts they have actually cut into the land to sort of make it flatter and you can see at the edges the edges are quite they're quite steep sided and they do look like they've just it's just a clean cut like the top angle uh, where the side of the slope meets and then the rest flattens off is quite a sharp angle and they just plant trees on the embankment at the side. I'm not sure why that is. I think it's one to hide it and two, I think tree roots actually sort of stop landslides, do they? I think they sort of bind the soil together and then when water comes, instead of pulling the land down, it's sort of absorbed or stopped by the trees. I'm not sure if that's true. Someone told me that once. And I was like, no, nah, bro, it's to, it's to hide the absolute hideous mess at the side of the road that they've made. <laughs> right, so we were... Right, we've got at least signals here, so just continue them from that side. Now, I wanted an airport for Swansea and Cardiff. And I wanted it... Ah, well, hold the fort... Right, may end up r removing this whole station. How big is a big airport? A small airfield. Yeah, you might be the one. You could be the one. Right, it's right beside mountains, which is bad. Don't want that. Right, was there a reason I tunneled this out? There might have been a reason why I tunneled that out. Again, it's kind of close to like mountains and stuff. How about here? And then I could get a little train that sort of pops into it. Maybe. Not a train that goes from Bristol. Because that would be a nightmare. Could get a little train from Gloucester that bypasses it and then goes into Cardiff and then down to Swansea. And that could be the airport route. Now this is a pretty small airfield. 
It will take some planes. Dirt strip, grass strip. Now they're they're super small. Passenger airfield, concrete strip. This seems better. It seems a hell of a lot smaller as well. Right. Place that in there for just now. That's just a placeholder. Uh, I need to get like bridges and stuff over here, which is going to be interesting. I think I should be able to do it now. I think freight is going to go in here. So we'll have freight station here and then it could pop off. And deliver stuff to Swansea and Cardiff. And we've got freight at this side as well. I think that's the only way I'm going to get freight in. The other freight I'm severely distressed about is Bristol. My only thing I can imagine is it's going to have to go like over here. Now Bristol is starting to grow out this way. And I really don't want the city to grow out that way because it leaves buses bus routes and a sort of perilous one-way route to go all the way up here and then all the way back down here now there is already going to be a perilous bus route that's going to head down here but I'm thinking about making that inner city buses once I get the sort of inner city or tourist sort of coaches Right, so that's all gone. So Bristol took a severe hit there. I'm happy for it to grow out this side because I think eventually it ain't going to be able to grow anymore. I'm going to get a bridge over here. It's going to go out that way and go into there. And then we can get this connected up. A highway to sort of go down to Gloucester here. I'll have to figure out how I'm going to do that. But we'll cross that bridge. I will do the highways offline because some people find them kind of boring. And they are kind of boring, but hey -ho. Most people are interested in the old trains. Right, I think this is all signaled up, right? Switch signals on. Make life easier for yourself. Right, that. Okay, there's severe lack of signals over here. One, two. And one, and two. Right, sweet. And then head down this way, down that way. Right, now this is going to be interesting because we've got so many merging tracks and whatnot. Alright, so down before Reading. Right, so hold on. Uh, nut ships. Oh, yeah. We need a wind farm, obviously. Uh, one do and that one there yes that one there okay and do a couple on the bridge and then maybe like a couple in here and then this one out there and that one in here Okay, let's try and build the route. This should be interesting. New line. Line 1. Dink. So went to there on... I'm assuming it's platform 1. Uh, closest to the building side. So that's good. And then into platform... Who the hell knows here? Oh, okay, that's good. Uh, Nut 10 going on 9. Oh! That's interesting. Yeah, go in on 9, manage line, add a station after Reading. You're going to head out to Bristol on 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yes. You're then going to continue on down to here. Sweet. And then you're going to continue on to there. Sweet. And then you're going to go into Milf, Milford Haven. And then you're going to head back. Go into Swanus Sea. On four. Right, it's the first time it's, like, it's ever not tried to change up its track. Which is astonishing. 
Yeah, other train is going to branch off and try and go up that valley. <laughs> That's going to be wild. Uh, right. Into Cardiff. On one. Yes. Into Bristol. On six. Uh, 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 uh. Ooh, right. It did change over at the last second there. That's nice. Into Reading. On six as well. Oh, it's ten. Ah, yeah, because we've got these two single lines. Okay. My bad. And then back down to London on one. Holy crap, that actually works. Make it red. Now, this will be the RLP Rail Passenger Inner City. Wheels, wheels to LDN, wheels to London. Right, I need a train, finally, right. Can I launch a train, well you will be able to launch a train from the depot if you connect up this too much curvature lies oh well there is too much curvature when you try to do stu stupid stuff like that right you where are you gonna what area are you happy with is that gonna look stupid no it's fine All right Double slip switch, yes. Right, now this line is connected before I go and try and release something that's not going to work. Actually, I should release it from one of these depots. Right, that's easier. Uh, multiple units, diseases. I want one of these. Add, buy, set it on a line. RLP ITC, now it's wheels, so it'll be right down. There it is. It can be launched from there. Hallelujah. That's good. Uh, and it's going to bypass. I mean, I've never actually jumped in a train that is sort of. Right. Let's look at this. No, there's nothing on the old warning screen to say that we've screwed something up so that's really surprising right jump on here there we go look at the trains hello train in the only yard in the entire entire map I should make more yards just been struggling to find the time Yeah, struggling to find the time to add, like, detailed stuff. Because I'm currently trying to detail uh, the Workers and Republic Soviet... No, Workers and Resources Soviet Republic map. Now, we've got a couple of trains sitting over there. That's nice. How does it look from behind? It is kind of laggy over here. I will train heading out. Intercity 125... We now there are those uh, Norfolk class 47s. Or class 47s, who the hell knows? Wait, this train's gonna get stuck because there's a, like a ridiculous amount of freight runs on here. It is actually <laughs> heading down the track the wrong way. But I think it should be good. Actually, I think it might be okay. The other train at the other side is holding at the traffic lights on the bridge there. So that's... Thank God. Because if that came down the other way, we would have been at the Mexican standoff time once again. 
Uh, there's the. Oh, I was about to say there's the train on the bridge. Right, but we are past the bridge now. We're heading off at 72 miles per hour. 75 miles per hour is the top speed of this track. Now, bus routes. Yes, we're going to need many bus routes. Bus routes. Probably another one for Bristol. Uh, definitely one for Cardiff, Swansea, and Milford Haven. Those all need bus routes. Right, into the station we go. Very nice. Uh, at some point I may create the Eurostar line. Now, the weird thing is, there's no old school Eurostar. They're all the sort of brand new ones, which aren't available yet. And I don't know when the first Eurostar livery train becomes available. Right, who it teleported me back here. That was scary. I wanted to be here. Right, so we've got another 125 or class 43. Yeah, another class 43 rolling. Now, the ones I was speaking about, uh, the Norfolk diesels. So we've got a few more vehicles to use. Let's head up into diesels. We've got 10 variants of this. Uh, we've got more freight, so we'll get more freight up and running. Uh, I want to use some more of the blues and some more of the greens and stuff. So we will uh, we will try and use some more of them. Uh, the peaks, we'll try and add a few more peaks as well. But if we head in here, yeah, right. So there's Norfolk, Old Oak Common. Right, I'm going to have to... Ah, right, it's Network Southeast Livery. Okay, I've actually got trains where I can add that livery too. Which is nice. Really nice. I want to get another executive inner city rolling from somewhere. Uh, but right now, we're pretty good. Class 58 freights. Coal sector. Yes, let's get more coal. Rail freight, grey. There's tons of stuff we can actually use. And not much time to sort of use it. I mean, I'm trying to cut it down to 10 episodes before we pop off into the future. Trans Pennine. I can't remember where Trans Pennine livery actually lives. But there are diesel multiple units. So, class 150, zero. What is GMPTE again? Greater Manchester Passenger Transport Executive Red. So, we've got Regional Railways, Sprinter. So I think we can use that anyway. First Great Western. It took me ages to realise what FGW stood for. First Great Western. <laughs> Northern Rail. Uh, another regional sprinter. And then we've got seven liveries of these. So First Great Western, local lines. For great uh, Arriva trains, Wales. So we'll get them up and running. Greater Manchester, Wessex trains. Wessex beside London, right? Is it? Wessex. It's beside Essex. Essex on east, Wessex on right hand side. Can't remember. But anyway, we're going to leave it there for that episode. Let's go and find our... Where are you? You're there. 17 people went to jump on board this thing already, which is pretty good. That was super laggy. Sort of trying to come through there, but it's off. It's on its way. That's very nice. We'll do something with freight next. I want to get more iron ore up and running. Uh, possibly we'll get some more coal and iron done. I'd like, like to do something with farming as well. We've not touched that yet. Maybe try and complete a few shopping lists. So we'll continue down at the south. I mean, we've done London. Lots of other sort of areas around London are getting sort of goods and stuff. So this guy is heading out, very nice, heading off to Bristol. And then he can continue down to Wales, but I will have to do the... What will I have to do? Oh, I'll have to do the, the bus routes and stuff. But we'll leave it there for that episode. As always, if you did watch this and you would like to leave a like, comment, or dislike, 
please feel free to do so. And if there's more you'd like to see in the future, then hit that subscribe button. I've been Danny Boy, this has been Transport Fever 2 on the UK map, and I will catch us later.